Okay, happy Saturday, everyone. Here's a new cup a friend brought over to me yesterday. How adorbs. So I flipped my page in my sketchbook and we're on black today. So I'm using a white charcoal pencil to draw in my shape. Okay, now let's start painting. I'm using some yellow ochre in my gouache palette and mixing it with some white to add a few accents. And then I'm, um, oh, adding a striped tail. I always add a few things. I change things up a lot because it's fun. And there I'm mixing a rich teal that once again I add some more white gouache into it. My theory is if it's not fun, there's no reason to continue doing anything. I hope the fun I have doing this uh, expresses itself through this little video. Okay, I mixed a little bit of umber with the teal to create just a little bit of darkness, a little bit of form. Okay, so now I take my lovely little white gouache and start filling in some details. And you need a good brush with this that gets to that comes to a really nice point so you can get in and out and carve around all the little shapes, especially some of those shapes are still wet. So you've got to be pretty precise. And gouache on just about any paper, but especially a dark one like this black charcoal paper I have um, will require two, three, if not four uh, layers to really be nice and white. And here, just to add some reflections and uh, create the illusion of more form, I'm adding some lightness to the cup. And on this little episode of coffee mugs and teacups, um, I'm using pastel pencils this time. I don't think I've used those in the previous episodes. Like I said, I love mixed media. Just love it. There's my white charcoal pencil. Thank you, Debbie C. Love you. Okay, I punched out a heart shape out of scrapbook paper and glue sticked that in. And now I'm creating a shape so the date stamp will work on that since it's black ink. And a couple more different yellows in the pastel pencil range. Added whiskers today. I forgot yesterday. It was an afterthought. And now I'm just going bold with the red pastel pencil oh. rather than just have that red heart shape alone. And here I'm adding the word kitty with thy food a pen. And there it is, my version. And the supplies that I used, color, no, let's say pastel pencils, food a, there's my gouache palette. And there you have it. Thanks for showing up today. Take care.